Day two of Baguio and we're going down for breakfast. Hi. Hi. Hi, baby. Excited. Bye. I'm going to do some work too. Bye. Going down. Oh. Oh. Wow. Wow. <laughs> This is the dining area of Hotel Supreme Convention Center where we had our breakfast buffet for two days. Time for lunch! Hi! We're going somewhere else. It's already lunch time. It's 11.30. Time to eat here. So, earlier, we were going to work. I work And later, possibly I work when I And then, this is it. We're going to Hi! Hello! Baby! And we decided to have our lunch at Farmer's Daughter. This is located at Tamawan Village, along Benguet Road, Baguio. Um, this was recommended to us by my friend. And oh my god, we love the food. The pako and this pork. It's so delicious. We really loved it. And yeah, it's, it's a must try. After having lunch, we decided to have some coffee, so we went to this place, it's called Igorot Charm Cafe, it's near Tamawan village, um, the coffee was incredible and I also did some work there too. Hello, what's up baby? Then we went to Tamawan Village. As you have seen in the previous clips, the entrance fee is very cheap. Um, you will see a lot of plants and trees here. Lots of walking around. Medyo nakakapagod, lalo na if you are with a toddler or with a kid, um, because you have to carry them. It's it's a little slippery in this place, maybe because it's it's cold in Baguio, I'm not so sure. But if you love nature, this is the place to be. There is also a village cafe in here where you can have your lunch while looking at the greenery around. It's so beautiful in here actually. Um, if you love meditating or just looking at flowers, you will love this place. And there are also some igorots here. Um, they show their cultural dance. And yeah, just lot of, lots of tourists here. Strawberry farm. Papa 
Malipas lang kami ng oras while the baby is sleeping. So we're already here, just taking a rest. And mamaya magpe-picture picture na kami. Unfortunately, we were not able to go around the strawberry farm itself because it was so hot at that time. So we just bought some strawberries and took some pictures. And luckily, we still had the time to go to Burnham Park. But as you can see, it's already dark at this time. But you can still see a lot of people walking around, strolling, or eating some street food. Um, what makes this place really nice is even if it's already dark, the weather makes it very cozy and comfortable. Yeah, I like this place. Time for dinner! Then we had our dinner at Chef's home and oh my god, we again loved the food. And luckily we were able to have dinner with my brother and sister-in-law too, who was also celebrating their anniversary that day. After dinner, we just spent the rest of the night in our hotel room. For day 3, we just had our buffet breakfast again. Then I did some work and then we already check out of the hotel. And for day 3, I decided to use my Oppo as my vlogging camera the whole time. First place that we went to is the Bell Church. It's located at Bell Church Road, La Trinidad Benguet. The Bell Church is a Chinese temple of the Chinese Filipino indigenous religious organization of the same name in La Trinidad Benguet, Philippines. That's according to Wikipedia. Although there are a lot of people in here, the place is still peaceful and maybe because it's it's not really allowed to be noisy in here. Mm. 
lots of people are taking pictures in here just because it's very Instagrammable. The place is so beautiful. Yes, the next place that we went to is very famous here in Baguio. It's in Sitio Butiutiu where there are lots of colorful houses designed perfectly. It's very Instagrammable and at first we wanted to take a picture at the bridge but the line was very long so we just decided to take pictures beside the bridge. Then it's lunch time, so we decided to have our lunch at Chaya. It's called Chaya, it's a Japanese restaurant. It's located at Legarda Road, Barangay Campo, Shioko, Baguio. Um, the food was so amazing. We as a family love Japanese food, that's why we really enjoyed this place. It's very authentic. So that's the end of our Baguio trip. As you can see in here on our way home, it's still very foggy even though it's already past lunchtime. It's already in the afternoon. Yeah, we, we just enjoyed Baguio. Um, although it's a bit crowded, we still had fun. I hope you like this video and make sure that you have already watched the first part of our Baguio trip. And if you like it, please like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.